All right, everyone, we're back to Super Paper Mario. We're on to the whole deal with Francis and his fortress and fighting him directly now. So Mario Peach Bowser, scale the tree, defeat Dementia. Yep, we did that last time. The exhausted heroes were relieved to finally see the ivory towers of Fort Francis. I'm sure they were. Was Tippy safe? Was the next pure heart really waiting for them ahead? Your only answers were the strange voices carried on the wind from inside the fort. Well, it is Francis talking, so I imagine it is pretty strange. Probably sounds even nerdier than Sheldon from Big Bang Theory. Okay, so where is that dweeb Francis? Oh, sorry. So this is where that dweeb Francis lives. There we go. That's how we talk. Anyway. I know. It's crazy time talking. And your wife just said, I have, I've had a hard time talking this week. I'm like, yeah, I know. It's crazy. Can't say words. Anyway, so what has this castle got over mine? Uh, it's bigger. Do you think Tippy is all right? I'm starting to worry. I was like, yep, she's fine. No worries there. Tippy is just fine. Huh? He's in a cage and Francis is taking pictures. <laughs> so high technical. I totally undiscovered digi butterfly species. I must document it. Okay. Mario. Yes, shake that thorax. The Digi Butterner forum guys will be so jealous when I post these shots online. I'm sure they were, will be jealous. Meanwhile, Mario is going to kick your butt. No entry unless you're a super genius like me or a totally hot babe. Stay out. Oh, okay. Hold on. Flip. E eat him, huh? Don't rub your face against the pop filter. What are you doing? Okay. I know. Oh, hold on. He's me distract me. Hold on. I gotta wait. Gotta wait. Let's go down the pipe. Alright. We need Thorough. Pixel and no. Thoro, thank you very much. Grab it, buddy. And there we go. Oh, stop. Okay, not the microphone. Not the microphone. Stop making all kinds of noises, Isma. You're distracting all the people watching this. Ah, key to Fort Francis' door. Okay, good. Good. So Peach is going to be very much key to this whole mission here. Hold on, Yzma. Okay, I, I know. Come on. My cat Yzma is just being real lovey, wanting to rub up against everything. Being a kitty. Next, we'll be stepping on the keyboard of my computer, which is recording my voice. Bam. Oh. Welcome home, master. Uh, okay. I'm not your master, but alright. Hold on, Yzma. Okay. Turn around this way. Turn around this way. Okay. Lay down there. Okay. Save progress. Yes. Save progress. Got it. Okay. Alright. So, anything good if we flip? Anything useful? No. No. He is in 3D also. <laughs> we push him all the way with the door. Today is the street date for Prince of the Unicorns, Volume 15. Do not forget. Okay. He likes Prince of the Unicorns. Baseball game in extra innings has delayed the start of Starship x Not. Ah yes, the x Not from Thousand Year Door. I just had to record meow start time by 30 minutes to compensate. Yes, he has a lot of cat themed stuff. He's in the cats and butterflies. Okay, so we have Francis behind that door. And let's see. And Tippy. Okay. 
Thanks for moving commercial breaks from your recorded programs. Well, that's nice of the kitty robot. New space combat sim Starship X Not Space Bloops has arrived by mail. Well, that's good to know. He's in the games. We didn't check 3D there, did we? Hold on, let's go back real quick. Real quick, check the 3D. Flip into 3D space. Anything good? Anything? Anything useful? Nope. I mean, they're at different levels, but other than that, nothing really useful. Nothing we can use. Moving on forward. So we can open the door and save Tippy. I have cataloged all the Master's comics and filed them away. Do not think I did it out of the kindness of my Robo heart. They are beginning to clog vital fire escape routes from the castle. Well, that's definitely a problem. Okay, dead end here, so let's flip. Ah, there we go. Hold on. Um, okay. Get past you. Okay, I don't think we can uh, harm this one. Okay. Let's try. What happened? Chloe gets, gets startled? Chloe, well, it's okay. My dog just got startled by a plastic bag. It's funny. Oh, Bowser, stop it. Okay. Oh, okay, we just do this. Gain levels. Okay. He's getting us nowhere. Characters, Mario. Oh. We're just gonna go in the door now. Gonna keep on going, we can't beat that giant cat robot. We can beat those. Okay, hold on. Uh-oh. Not good, people. Not good. We need some healing. Stomping disturbs the master's nap time. Okay, that tells us what to do. We need to stomp. Let's go through the first. Anything useful? Nope, just two doors. Okay. That are hanging. So, first off, let's use an item. Some live shroom, shroom shake. These are shroom shake, so we can heal up. All right, let's get Thudley here. We need a stomp bit here. Do some stomping. Explore some doors. Bam! Drop the door, and suddenly we can go in. Cause that's how. Um, we can't go there yet. We need a new pixel. We need a, one that allows us to ride him like a skateboard. Or a hoverboard, really. More more hoverboard than skateboard. Mm hmm. Okay. Okay. Okay, so I need Peach. I need Peach to... Oh, that's wrong. Okay. Characters, let's get Peach out here so we can float. Float us over there, Peach. Excellent. Now, flip with Mario. Alright. 
They're cat bombs. Moving on. Alright. So, three. What is that over there? I need to hold something to get that. Oh! There we go. Thanks for coming over here. Appreciate it. And there we go. Why are you taking a long time to fill that in? There we go. Now it's fully drawn. Regain a level. How close are we? Oh, we're still a ways off. We still have uh, about 14,000 points. So we got some ways. We're start getting some stylish points. We all stylish with our flipping around. Oh, okay. Reach the door to Master's private room. For security purposes, you must confirm your identity. Okay. And spawn a security question with either true or false. Video game soundtracks are totally high technical. Uh, that sounds like something Francis would say, so true. Uh, true. Oh, when I want a Starship X not Series 3, probably true, yes. Enter the passcode. A passcode? A passcode. I don't say anything about a passcode. Deploy security measures. Ah, dog's barking. Bowie! Stop barking, come here. Uh-oh. Okay. Let's see here. Get the bomb out. <laughs> Lay down, Chloe. It'll work. Lay down. Lay down. Come on. Lay down. Now. Good girl. Alright. Bam, gotcha. Nope, need to grab it. Okay. Throw, please. Flipping is no use. Okay, got it. Go racking up the points. Flip. Oops. Okay, so probably could use this. Let's see. Bam. Can we get there from here? Okay. Room on the right, 2323. Room on the left, 2828. Okay, so either 2323 or 2828. Um. Thudley, get over here. We need a stomper. Okay. Hi, Gamma. How's Ijima doing? Bam. We get a new pixel just like that. Okay, looks like we have freedom here. We have a cross-shaped pixel. That's interesting. I didn't know pixels were religious items, but apparently so. 
Found the amount. Didn't know what I was going to do. Thank you, thank you. I've been shut up in here forever. You'll never catch me in there again. I should pay you. I'm at your service. I'm sure you can find a use for my talent. So this guy likes to collect pixels, apparently. Better keep an eye on my pixels. Hold on a second before we get all friendly. We should see if we're on the same page. You met Francis, right? What do you think of the guy? Your first impression? Uh, nerdy. Ah, I see, I see. Anything else about him to catch your eye? Uh, he's into butterflies. What do you think about him? A monster, tech geek, a stallion. A tech geek. A nerdy butterfly fanatic, basically a tech geek. Yep, that's about it. Okay, we have good harmony. I think we're perfectly together, nothing can touch us. Alright, good. This guy is like a hoverboard, essentially. Carry the hovering platform. Ha. Ha ha. Ha 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 ha. That's so funny. Anyway. The puns are just thick in this game. When you're riding carry, you'll move faster and can breeze over spiked floors. With me, you can get places in a hurry. Go ahead, give me a spin. Sure, we'll go for it. Oh, you can jump with him too. Okay. Okay, so where do we go? Not in there. Okay. Ah, I see. I see. There is the hidden exit. Go in this room. Back to the beginning. Now we gotta go backtrack again. Hold on. Hold on. Okay, we can go in this door now. So we have carry the hovering carrying pixel. Super secret lair. Drew that one. True. And true. Okay. Oh shoot, what was the numbers again? Dang it. Okay, let's see. Two, three, two, three. The other one is two, eight, two, eight. Huh. Digital kitty, apparently. What's in the super secret room? Who knows? A full heal. This robot's dangerous, apparently. So we need a bomb. Must buy this month. Excess, uh, Excess Express train set. Ms. Meow's doll with real smooching action. That's kind of creepy. Survival horror romance sim. How do, how did those? 
Well, okay, sorry. I did play Doki Doki Literature Club, so I can't really question that. Anyway, uh, Larry Koopa Zombie and Heartbreaker. Okay. Magnus Von Grapple fig figure, Tanuki suit made with real Tanuki fur. What is a Tanuki? That's what everyone would like to know. Harder than Bedrock? The Rock Hawk story? Uh, so many Thousand Year Door references. Uh, issue 47 of Cyborg Wart. And that radio control professor, frankly, and a lot more sweet stuff. So many Mario references here. You mean to thud you that chest down? Hold on. Go 3D here for a minute. Ah, I see. And a key! So one side of the fort key. Got it. There's a screen there. Hold on, what's this? Computer screen. Nothing of use. So let's leave here and now go to his room and get the other key. Come here, Carrie. We need you. We need our hoverboard. And a real hoverboard, not like the ones they came out with that aren't really hoverboards, but they call them hoverboards. Okay. There we go, try that again here. We're gonna need Peach coming up here soon. Cause if Mario and Co. If they do the uh, the door, then that's gonna end poorly. Cause the cat door has laser beam eyes, and we'll proceed to use them. Stylish points. Come here, cats. Flying kitty robots. You got hit a little bit there, it's okay. There we go. We want the points, we want the level up here. Story all of Francis' it's kitty robots because he kidnapped our butterfly. True, true, true to all your nerd questions, yes. And two, eight, two, eight. To carry meow missed you. Okay. At least there's no elevator this time. Uh, 
There we go, now we're up here. And key number dos. There we go. Oh, there's a poster of Peach on that door. Go back in for a minute. Flip real quick. Nothing really that we can explore a bunch of kitties and stuff. Okay. That poster of Peach clues you in that you probably want to lead with her going forward. So let's get to the security door with the two keys. Alright, where are we? Okay. So switch to Peach. And let's see. Port key. Key accepted. Port key, key accepted. Meow. Both keys confirmed. Meow. Only Master Francis and Totally Hot Babes are allowed to enter. We enter to see if you're compatible with Master Francis. Please answer the following questions with true or false. Computer games and hot babes are totally hot tech. Yeah, okay, true. We know this one. It's lim if it's li Yeah, limited edition by it. True. I bought games I never played. Okay, true. If it's got fierce giant robot and a giant robot combat, it's insta buy. Uh, true. They're not dials or action figures, real fire punching action. True. I've dumped a friend over an argument about Starship X not propulsion technology. Sure. A sweet color illustration is way more important than the storyline. You know, if all your questions are supposed to be true, that's not very good security. And pull the top card from a pile of comics. Find the mint condition one. True. Yeah, your, your security questions are terrible. Francis, get better security questions. Just a hint. I mean, after we, we beat you and stomp you into oblivion, then change your security questions to be harder. Just saying. My first love was an anime character. That's disturbing and will say true. Not for me, but for Francis, because I'm trying to get in the, in the door here. Anyway. I love going on message boards and complaining about games I've never played. Sure. Yay, we won. Now... If we didn't have Peach, we would have been shot with eye lasers. Nur, who are you? Uh, here comes the fun part. What are you doing sneaking in my room, huh? Ever heard of p privacy? Oh, there you are, Francis. I've been looking all over for you. For me? Uh, <laughs> oh, he's freaking out. It's a hot girl. Hot babe in room. Let me do a real girl in my room. <laughs> Not a robot girl. A real girl. He's really freaking out. Way too excited, sweat sweaties forming. What? Can't talk to girls and skip my laptop from Franny Pack. Booting up swoon.exe. Activating nerd to babe interface mod with real time wooing. Okay. Oh, this is a fun game here. Because you actually make print uh, Princess Peach actually start to consider thinking about Francis, but then she snaps up. She's like, wait, what am I saying? So it's kind of hilarious to do that, but we'll go through it and try to be normal about it. Try to. Maybe. Who knows? Uh, welcome to my castle. How do you do? What on earth is that? What's going on here? I put this baby up whenever it's time to talk to... <laughs> the ladies? Okay. Sweet. It's time for my swoon.exe program to work its magic. Where should I start? Speak. Talk to Hot Babe. What is your name? My name? <laughs> okay. Oh, me, I'm Peach. Tell me your name first. You can call me annoyed. Uh, what should we say? Call me annoyed. Why not? Whoa. What an ice cream. She's so cold. I'm shocked. Alright, she had to get, that's pretty hot too. Okay. New feelings of attraction, Francis 
Francis's passion leveled up. What? Okay, smooch. Nope. Look at Hot Babe. You're so cute, like a princess straight out of an anime or video game. Well, the second part's right. <laughs> you can be feisty, but I must say, it, it um adds to your charm. You think I'm charming? Okay, so, am I really cute? Tee hee. You're making me blush. I'll show you feisty. I'll show you feisty, why not? I'm feisty. I'll show you feisty. Lay it on thick like that, and you'll get it. Eep. I'm so sorry, I don't know what I was thinking. Oh, forgive me, my queen. I'm not a queen, I'm a princess. She's super cute when she gets angry. Peach's charisma leveled up. Francis' passion leveled up. Oh, this is not going well. Or it is going well. I don't know. Next move. Inventory. Give item. A pink princess signed poster. Okay. Oh, um... Is like... The first choice is if you're really... You know, wanna fall for him kind of thing. This is kind of like lukewarm and this is like no way. We're gonna stick with no way. Here we go. This junk won't win me over. We started this path, we're going through completely. You trying to impress me with this stupid thing? You've got to be kidding. Oh, I'm so sorry. Not impressed at all. Boy, she must really be into... Must be really into this stuff. She's like me. Peach returned the poster. Francis is impressed. Francis' passion leveled way up. Whoa. That wasn't supposed to go that high. This is going poorly. Trini, she said no. That being a pest. Oh, I mean. Indy wife is yelling at the cat while she's trying to make dinner here. Yeah. Wow, we are like so perfect for each other. It's destiny. We should get married. M married? If you would have me. <laughs> Let's take it slow. So how much do you make? <laughs> oh, okay. Let's go with that one. How much do you make? I didn't have much choice. There wasn't really any... I had three choices, Peach, and they were all bad. Don't yell at me about this. Okay, who's picking these responses from me anyway? I'm not marrying this dork. I shouldn't even be having this conversation. I came to save Tippy. Where is she? Tippy, hmm, Tippy, Tippy. There's no Tippy command here. What's she talking about? Let's have had it. You better bring her out now. Peach used Boomer. Boomer exploded. It's super effective. <laughs> oh, no, my graphics card. That was the only known copy of the Nur 2 Babe patch, and now it's gone forever. Nur, real babes are scary. Peach? Tippy, oh, I was so worried. You you came to save me. So, you've come to raid my fort and steal Francine. No, it's Tippy, not Francine. Well, well, I, no, I won't let you. By the way, I came up with the name Francine on my own. Isn't it sweet? No, it's not sweet. At first I thought it was a little weird that you could talk and everything. The digi butterner form reaction convinced me you were high technical. My only sniff online friend. Francine, so no one will take you away from me. Uh, get new friends? Don't steal butterflies as friends? We're gonna have Peach kick his butt. Alright. Uh, 
Now how do we do this here? Huh, I have an idea. Hey Boomer, come here. We bounced him in the face. There we go. Two at once. Gotcha, Francis. This hot babe is gonna kick your butt. Oh. Where you at? Gotcha. Them all blow up. It's fine. They can blow themselves up. Whoops. You're hurt, Peach, there, Francis. That's no way to win the babes over. Try to blind me, will you? Oh, uh, nuts. How dare you. No one eats Princess Peach. Oh, he missed him. Hold on. Gotcha. Oh, don't swallow me again. What are you doing? Keep jumping. Got ya. You missed there. Got ya. This hot babe kicked your butt, Francis. That's what hot babes do, you say? All right. According to Indie Wife, hot babes kick uh, geeky chameleons' butts. Especially one's named Francis. There we go. Mara, you guys came to save me. Thank you. Thank you, Mario. I'm so happy. What is that? A pure heart. A pure heart, but how? It's like Tippy's heart just burst with happiness and released a pure heart, or... Mario, I was just so happy when I saw you that you'd come to save me. Please, take it. All right, now we have a, gre a green pure heart. Mostly green. I mean, it's kind of turning blue, blue and green and yellow, and a little bit of red in there. But it's mostly green. We'll call it green. We got a pure heart. Well, that's nice of you to say again. I like how it keeps telling us we have a pure heart. It's a very kind game. I like it. Very flattering. The fourth pure heart appeared in a dazzling flash of mysterious light. I made it appear. The group was puzzled by this and many other riddles, I'm sure. So you're not hurt, as Tippy full of concern? Somehow Tippy seemed different than before. She had started to change. Mario simply shook his head and started a long journey back to Flipside. Yeah, he shakes his head a lot, too. Save progress, yep. Saving, please do not turn off power for save complete. Good. Yay, we've saved the game. 
More exposition here, and that is how the ruffians managed to best me. Uh, they are strong to be sure, very strong. Dare I say they might be strong enough to defy the prophecy. Spare Count Black your theatrics. The light prognosticus is false. The dark prognosticus holds the answer to eliminating heroes that rise to stop us. Oh my, that's the first time that morsel of information has touched my ears. Do tell. In due time, Dementio. In due time. Oh, Nastasia, it's time we set him on these pests. By him, they mean a brainwashed Luigi. It's no real secret, but anyway. That'll be next time. Um, yeah, um, I can take care of that for you, Count. Lovely, exclaimed Count Black. Return to your post, my dear minion. As you command, Count, hail Black. And they all vanish. Does something trouble you, Nastasia? Yeah, Count, you know, there's still time. You can still change your mind. That's enough, Nastasia. We've already come this far, so we shall forge on. You needn't stay by Count Black's side. You can depart with my blessing. Um, no, my Count, I won't be doing that. My life is already sworn to you. Yeah, it's belonged to you since the day you saved me. I'll be sticking it out with you until my game ends, okay? That pleases you. My, 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 how interesting. Nastasia and the Count have such a, such deep conversations. Hmm, just what is our dear Count playing at? Ah, uh, well, I'll let him worry about that. I must attend to my own projects. Timpani, why? Why do you avoid me? Oh, oh, unhand me. Huh? You're crying, why? Timpani, you must tell me what has happened. It's nothing. Don't worry about it. Just forget it. Oh no, Timpani, is my father behind this? I'm, I'm just an ordinary girl. No matter how much I love you, we must part. Timpani, I... This is goodbye, Blue Mirror. There's no other choice. This is our fate. Okay. I'm going to end it right here. Um, good place to end it. We have saved it at this point, so we'll be able to pick it up at this uh, juncture. So, the plot thickens, apparently. We know uh, Dementio is not on the Count's side from the last episode, and there's some hesitation with uh, Nastasia, or Nastasia. I don't know how you pronounce that name. I'm going to say Nastasia because she's acting kind of nasty and on Count Black's side. But yeah. Yeah, all kinds of good stuff for the story, and we'll pick it up, put the next pure heart in place, open the next door, and we'll get a, another pixel by going back to the level we were just at in, uh, what was that, 3-1 we're at? I don't know. I've lost track. But anyway, we'll go to that next, next part right there. But thank you all so much for watching. Thank you for being subscribed. I appreciate all of you. Be sure to follow me on Twitter, on Instagram. Also, follow me on Twitch. I live stream there on Sundays and Tuesdays now. So, make sure you check me out there and hit the notification there so you know when I'm live and when you can watch me. And we will see you guys next time. You stay awesome. We'll see you then.